So when we play this game, ruck touch, the expectation is you're going to be evasive. Because if you run straight at someone, you get stopped. Maybe you even go backwards. Someone defend on me, please. So we'll play, we're going to play across the field. It's just like normal touch, pass the ball. It has to be a two-handed tag to count. And as soon as he tags you, then you've got to have your exaggerated leg drive and go through the process. But I would expect to see guys getting the ball and they're here and they're trying to step, they're trying to get through here. And if they get tagged, then they're going to exaggerate a leg drive, they're going to rip to the ground, and they're going to try and place along. It's a little bit more athletic than I do. Okay? What, what, well, why would I be worried about you having your feet like, like that? Uh, Absolutely right. But, but how, do, how do you know that? <laughs> Physics, good work, good work. <laughs> I love you, I love you, I love you, you uh, students, bloody magnificent, come up with magnificent answers. So, get, get your feet facing towards these guys, and lean into me, and I want you to push me back, go. Okay, hold of you, before you break me. Right, turn around now, feet facing forward, get lower, and go. So what's the difference? He's got no leg drive. He's got no power with his feet facing sideways. And what happens a lot, lean into me again, just with your feet facing sideways, is what a lot of good players will do. I want you to I want you to pump your legs to go forward, go. Again get him down here, tuck away at the ball, turn over. Okay, so he needs to be in a powerful position and his feet need to be facing forward. Right, so expect to see that every time in the next one. So Karius. <laughs> Hey, um, so a couple of things. I talked to a couple of guys as they're going through. I reckon. Overall, a lot of our evasion was bloody good. You reckon? Yeah. Uh, I heard the feedback you guys are giving us some yeah. positive stuff, eh? So, what's something we could do a little bit better? Lower. Lower? Yeah. 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 Well, please, Same with this group, eh? Yeah. yeah. Well, steps for keep, keeping square. Yep. So, what I saw some guys, you're trying to be evasive. And so, I like your intention. But what you're doing is you're starting square onto him. And you're stepping there. And then you step back to here. Where are you? Right back, right back in the middle, you know, wondering why you're not getting to go forward. So, ideally, we want to line slightly outside. Look what happens on defence. The defence is normally slightly inside us, and we get at him here, but we get to there, and we try and go through the big fella that way. You did well to move across here. You caught me. <laughs> right, so, get at him, and then attack that corridor next to him, as we talked about, guys. Rather than getting a big shoulder like Jamie was talking about last night, you end up getting, you know, a forearm or a bicep. Uh, something you can get beyond. Right, we're going to go back and we're going to we're going to have a real short game of um, snake touch. We're going to play for three minutes. So the difference is going to be on this one. We have a ball carrier. We have a defender. So you're going to be evasive. Throw him a ball for someone, please. Oh, <laughs> always happens. Oh, it? Always happens. That's why I said throw you a ball, not me. <laughs> but um, so you're going to use a bit of evasion on me, just walking. He steps and I, I grab him there. And he's going to exaggerate a leg drive. So he's going to pump, pump, pump. And I'm going to make sure I get in front of him and try and then give him a bit of resistance. And one of the other players will come in. You need to be louder than this, of course, eh? Yeah, down here somewhere. But you're going to come in. So I'm in here trying to get off for resistance. And you're going to come in. What are you doing? Shoulder. Come in right here. Shoulder. Come in. Oh, shoulder shoulder on what I want you to do is you come in here and take me out. Okay. Come and take me out here. Beautiful. And he'll pump and go to ground, place long, and we'll play up there. Okay, so right. what happens is if you're really slow to get on, but don't react, then we're going to say turnover. Okay, all the other rules are applied for the ball carrier. If you don't get that right, turnover. But we're just going to do a little bit of clean out. Um, touch, we're going to play this for about four minutes. The last one was about seven, and I said three, I think. But um, <laughs> So we're going to, the rule this time will be come to me. You got a ball? <laughs> I mean, he's got a ball. <laughs> that ball there. Good work, mate. Um, so, you're going to use your evasion as you normally would. So, you're going to step, and I'm going to try to get it here, and I get it two-handed in. You're going to pump, pump, pump. 
and I'm going to try and get in front of you, and then you're going to go to ground, and this guy's just going to get into this position here, and I, I want you in here, not, don't want you low down on the ball, uh, putting your forehead on the ball or anything like that, because to get you off, I'm going to take you pretty hard, and this is more about technique, so we're going to get in here, and we're just going to tackle, so we're going to get our shoulders under the chest, and drive this guy off, okay, and you're going to hang on to him for a sec, before you let him go, ideally I'd want you to take him off his feet, so he's out of the game, but we won't do that today, but just hang on for half a second, and then we play.